guys, my name is Courtney and this is Classics with Courtney. Today I'm going to be talking about the book series that I think are the best book series to binge. Binging series is the way I like to read series. I love jumping on the bandwagon and kind of being with the action as each book releases. It's a lot of fun when everybody's really excited, but it's also just really great when all the books are out and you have them all and you can just read them all in one week, all in one go. It's just just so nice and sometimes the books just end up being a lot better when you can read them super quick. So binging series is my preferred way to read series but there are definitely some book series that are better than others to binge. Today I'm going to be talking about some of my favorite book series to binge read. The first book series I'm going to be talking about is Harry Potter. <coughs> no, I do not think the Harry Potter series is a good series to binge read. I know a lot of people will disagree with me on this. I grew up reading Harry Potter once a year. I was reading them as they came out and that was one of the most enjoyable experiences, just reading them slowly and really enjoying them. Harry Potter contains like one school year, so like getting to read it once a year is kind of like, I don't know, it just fits really well in my brain. I actually don't think the Harry Potter series is a good series to binge read, and I don't know if it's because I had to personally wait for each book to come out, but for whatever reason, I just like the experience of reading them once a year or reading them with space in between them so you can really enjoy them. But now let's get into the book series I actually Think are really good to binge read. One of the series that I read really recently and that I binge read was The Lunar Chronicle. As soon as I started reading the first book I just fell in love. It is just a really fun series and so I ordered all the books online right after that and I needed them straight away because I just wanted to continue reading them. This is a fast-paced sci-fi novel. It has a little bit of a twist because it has the fairy tale retelling aspect in it and the books kind of have a little bit of cliffhangers so you kind of want to know what's happening next. Characters are just so fun and lively. I really like the character interaction interactions. The series is just so fun and fast-paced and just a really fun read. Like there's serious stuff going on but it just feels overall just like a really fun, it kind of is like the Star Wars-esque fairy tale thing with just a group of really fun teenagers. Another book series that I think is great to binge is The Raven Boys. Again, like The Lunar Chronicles, as soon as I started reading the first book, I knew I was in love with the series. Like The Lunar Chronicles, this is a four book series. It's not really fast paced, but I can understand why people had a hard time picking up the next book in the series if they had to wait a year for it. The story writing is a little bit confusing and whimsical, and I've heard a lot of people kind of forget what happens in the book, and so it's really hard to transition into the next book because they don't remember what happened in the previous books. I was lucky enough that the whole series was out when I read it this year, which meant that I got to read them all really quickly in the same month together. It was just such a enjoyable experience and now the books kind of meld together. I could not stop reading these series. It was so weird because I read it and then I wanted to reread it but I also wanted to read the next book in the series. And this has a very fun cast of characters that are going on this kind of weird paranormal ghost hunt journey to find this Welsh king. I just love the characters so much and I love the writing and the story itself is just really really fun. It also has some serious darker moments. Also can be pretty suspenseful. I think The Raven Boys is a perfect series to binge read, especially if you don't want to get confused in between what happened during the books. Another really good series to binge read is the Percy Jackson books or just like any Rick Riordan series. And these books normally have a really fun cast of characters. The original series of Percy Jackson, I love Percy so much. He's just so fun and snarky and just ridiculously funny and he just makes a really good narrator for the series and it gets a lot more serious as the series goes on so I think that's what makes it a really good series to binge read. These books are also middle grade which means they're shorter and they have thicker type which means they're pretty short and you can finish the books pretty quickly. It's so fun. Rick always just has these ridiculous elements in his book which I love so much and they just make the books so enjoyable. The next one isn't really a series it's more of a novel collection, a short story collection, and this is the Sherlock Holmes books. I haven't actually finished this series, but the time I was reading it super quickly was when I kept reading them every single day. I was listening to it on audiobook and I would read a couple stories. The act of binge reading Sherlock Holmes, like, you know, reading eight different cases at the same time, they do tend to blend together. I think the act of binge reading the Sherlock Holmes series really kept me engaged through the series. I'm finding it a lot harder to finish the books because I'm not reading them consecutively. I just love Sherlock Holmes. Again, they're just funny and snappy and just really quick and enjoyable reads. I just find that one of the best ways to read the Sherlock Holmes series is to binge read them, to just get really engaged in the world of Sherlock home and just 
read them consecutively. Another great series to binge read, just in general, mangas I find are just great binge reads. I normally read mangas on my phone. I, I don't normally record them on Goodreads unless I'm buying them. The way I normally tend to read mangas is I will read all 30 or 100 chapters in one go. I can probably read 30 chapters of manga in a night. Manga chapters are just really short and fun and quick. The stories tend to be really snappy and they tend to pull you in right from the get-go in my opinion. Manga is just really addictive for me which just makes it really great for binge reading. The series in particular that I think is a perfect binge read is the Skip Beat series. This series has over 200 chapters which means you have a lot of material that you can read. And also this story is just really funny and snappy. You just want to keep reading it. It's weird because it does feel very fast paced. There's a lot going on in the series. A lot of transition time between um, different events and different plot lines that are going on. It sometimes can take a while for the setup. This series follows Kyoko as she tries to get into the acting business in Japan. Sometimes it takes a while for her to go through the audition process and to um, figure out her character and to get into the character and start filming. The author definitely focuses a lot of attention on setting up events. So if you have to wait between chapters, especially when like five chapters are just setting up an audition, it can kind of be um, not really boring, but it's just like, oh, I really want to know what happens next. Because there's so many chapters out, I think this series is a really, really good series to binge read because you don't have to wait for those transitions. You can kind of just fly through it. Choco is just so funny and ridiculous and over the top. I've read this series like two or three times and I just fly through it. Super fast paced, super fun and quick and I definitely recommend it. Okay guys, those are some of the series that I think are really just fun and great to binge read. Reading is just one of my favorite things to do with series. It's definitely my preferred form of reading. Tell me what series you think are really great to binge read in the comments down below. I'd love to find some more series like that. I'll see you guys later and keep it classy.